TMG North America is excited to introduce Tensium Myography, a powerful muscle performance measurement tool for athletes, strength and conditioning coaches, therapists, sports medicine practitioners, and doctors. Muscle by muscle, Tensium Myography is able to measure fast and slow twitch muscle activation recruitment patterns, muscle symmetries, muscle synchronization, and muscle fatigue. This valuable information can be used to optimize performance training, identify at-risk muscles and joints for injuries, and to rehab more effectively. Using Tensium Myography, the effects of training and rehab programs can be quantitatively monitored. Originally, Tensium Myography was developed as a muscle diagnostic procedure for the medical field uh, for degenerative muscle research. Uh, more recently, in about the last 10 years, they developed the sport application side through the software, and now we're seeing it used a lot among high performance athletes. Tensio myography is unique in that it is a very fast, very reliable, accurate diagnostic test. Uh, it captures a lot of objective measurements that are very um, informative for the practitioner, either as a trainer or a rehabilitation therapist. It's actually got over 50 independent research studies, uh, so those are, those are people that have used this practically in either muscle degeneration research or in sport application in terms of um, like ACL rehabilitation. Surgeon Djordjevic is the inventor and creator, and actually he is a leading uh, sports scientist as well as an athletic performance coach for high-end athletes. So he's worked a lot with track and field athletes through his development and actually coached uh, using this technology, he's helped coach over 70 medalists at world and Olympic events. Tensiomyography directly measure the activation pattern or recruitment model of the skeletal muscle. It's a simple, functional, and selective. Simple meaning that uh, it's quite easy to learn how to, to use. Functional meaning that you really uh, measure the function of the muscle. And the selective meaning that we measure muscle by muscle or even the part of the muscle. The value in tensiomyography is in its uh, diagnostic accuracy, uh, providing uh, quantitative results for the therapist to measure certain changes that they are having regardless of their intervention. Everything in the pathology, in the applied physiology, kinesiology, which is connected to muscle function or muscle activity, can be measured or can be evaluated through the tensiomyography. One of the Famous uh, Trek and Finlatis, Merlin Lotti, actually using tensiomyography a really long time. She was able to run an unbelievable result in the age of 45. The hardware would be uh, the tripod, the arm that holds the sensor, and then along with that we have our stimulator, which has an electrode hookup. We have our laptop. Uh, which has the software on it. It can either travel with a sports team um, or with an individual athlete, be set up at a single location. It takes up minimal space. It's very accurate, fast, and reliable. So the first thing it measures is called delay time. And what that is, is when the impulse goes to the muscle, how long does it take for that muscle to start contracting? Next is the contraction time, and that's the length of time it takes for the muscle to actually fully contract. After that, we have sustain time, and that would be how long a muscle can sustain that strong contraction for. Relaxation time is the time it takes from a full contraction down to relax below 50% of that contraction. And then displacement is actually how much the muscle displaces from the muscle belly. Our software can immediately develop four different kinds of reports. So our quick report, which is for the athlete, uh, that breaks down the information kind of in layman's terms, allowing the athlete to take in what the test has told them. So it'll provide them with actually a color-coordinated chart of the muscles that they need to work on and how they need to work on them. Our personal report, that's a bit longer and that has more of the raw data, and that's going to be for a physician, a team doctor, or a physiotherapist kind of working with an athlete. Uh, along with that, our trend report is more for rehabilitation. And then the last one is our group report, and that's more used in a team setting where either a coach or a trainer is going to want to look at how their team averages in terms of what their weaknesses are in their training programs, what the performance weaknesses are after games. So that would be the group report use. What we have actually is for each different sport, you're going to be using different muscles in different capacities, right? So we have a database that has uh, comparisons for every sport 
for elite level athletes. So if you're a kid coming in, getting tested, you can be compared against an elite basketball player, an elite soccer player, because for, again, for each of those sports, you're gonna have different muscle development through whatever the sport's asking of you. So what we've actually developed is we've developed activation exercises, and what they do is they teach an athlete's body to recruit fast twitch muscle fibers first. Okay, and these exercises aren't performed to, uh, to exhaustion, so all they're doing is they're, they're taking the muscle fibers that are predominantly fast twitch and they're using them right away. And then those are the muscles that are becoming repaired. So then you're going to be able to use more fast twitch fibers and use it in a better fashion.